Not your normal shooting video today. Most of the time you are worried about your power, your accuracy, but the thing that matters most is deciding what type of shot you should take and when. Let's go. All right, my friends, we're gonna break this down into three sections. We've got inside and up in front of gold. We've got just outside the box and then even further. When you are in inside of the box, normally the idea is to place it, of course, because if I could place it far post, right footed, perfect. So what's available to you here when you're this close on goal? Low and in the corners. Don't ever be afraid to throw out the toe poke if you're in this situation, because it'll give you a chance to get to the ball before the goalie would or before a defender would. You just Boom, it's in, right? So one thing you need to remember though, because we're not talking about your shooting form. I'm hoping that you guys all have good shooting form. If you are in this area and you're blocked by a defender here, you've gotta go high and you've gotta go hard. A la Ryan Giggs in the treble year or Landon Donovan against Slovenia in the World Cup. Guys, you have to smash this ball as hard as you can. If you miss, you miss. You don't have an option. If everything else is failing and you're this side of the post. That means no angle. Shoot high, shoot hard. You can also go through the goalie's legs, but guys, if you blast it, that's when you blast it, right? So by choosing the correct shot, you give yourself a better chance, and that is exactly what you'll see as we move out here to the top of the box. Here we are at the top of the box. Out here, you really only have two options. That's a bend, and that's a strike. Nothing else is really gonna work here. You can't just place it and pass it and it's gonna get into the box, especially with defenders and the goalie there. So when you're looking to bend the ball, you've gotta decide what side of the field am I on, right? Where is the actual action? Where, if you're on this side of the, the, the field, bending it around far post is probably best, all right? But never forget, you can also bend it near post by opening up your body. This is something you can also do. Open up your body, make it look like you're going there and cut it inside, right? From this angle, goalies are covering the near post, which gives us also the opportunity to strike. And when we want to strike, we don't want to throw all of our body into it. It just means when you strike, you strike hard. Don't be afraid to miss. It's fine if you miss. Oof. It's also fine when you hit a sick upper 90 shot, just like that. Oh! Now, one of the other things that you have available to you that I don't see a whole lot of guys do, and we can do a tutorial on this, is combining both the bend and the strike. Instead of just striking, and a bend comes from the inside, a strike comes from the top. If you put them together, you got some sort of weird, wicked bend shot, right? A shend. You got a shend. It's a word I just made up. So as you can see, we are way far outside of the box now. And when you've got a chance to shoot from here, be smart. If you're not the guy that can hit this shot, it doesn't make sense. Try to get closer in, look to play, look to fake the shot, right? But if you have to take a shot from out here, make sure your shooting form is good. Make sure you tap the ball out long enough that you can get yourself a good run up, okay? And you have two options here, full strike, and of course a knuckleball. A knuckleball is gonna be your great friend out here because you guys all know this, it's very unpredictable for the goalie. He doesn't know where it's gonna end up and neither do you. The best thing to do is choose the shot that leans towards your strengths. If you're the guy with the knuckleball, use that. If you're the guy with the shot, hit that. That is exactly what will give you a better success of putting the ball in the back of the net. That's the vid, my friends. You know exactly what to do. Like, comment, subscribe. I don't know, send me some food. Guys, we talk about food all the time. No one's sending me any food. Could I just get maybe a, I don't, just, Make sure to train. Uh, we'll see you later. God.